So, we got here. I'm gonna go over that equipment, guys. Happy Friday. Um, it's good Friday. Uh, I think just starting the day, so, so grateful. Just a little extra reminders to be grateful for a lot of things today. And um, I'm grateful that I get to spend my time with you guys, start off Good Friday with you guys. Um, it looks a little bit different. I know this weekend, going into this weekend is a little bit different for a lot of us. Um, we're very, for me, I grew up very, very traditional. Like on an Easter weekend, it was just, I mean, it was, we had down to like when we were dying eggs, when we were doing the Easter egg hunt and volunteering and, um, you know, doing you, all these family events and just being surrounded by loved ones and then just having the whole message of love just all weekend. Um, so I just, thank you guys for being here. Thank you for starting off my Good Friday with me and just being a piece of my love, being a piece of just 45 minutes where I get to start off with great gratitude for an able working body. And um, you guys are just beautiful. I love it. So <laughs> sentimental done. My name is Megan. I am a degree and a row former instructor out in Orange County. I teach at Trim Fitness and I teach at Hard Fit. Um, I miss my studios dearly, but I love that I get to spend this time here with you guys. So I'm going to go over the equipment that we're going to be using today and then we'll jump right into it. So I'm going to have that resistance tube in here. So when we work into those arm sections, you can do everything right here that we're doing with the resistance tube with a pair of hand weights. Don't worry about it. Work it out. Get it done. Okay. Um, also, I'm going to have those discs, those sliders. So these are something that's going to move across the floor nice and smooth. Onto that hard surface, you can use slidey socks, you can use towels. If you're on a carpet, you can use paper plates, you can use frisbee discs, you can do Tupperware tops, whatever works for you. Um, and then we got a heavier resistance band. Uh, so I want you to grab your thicker one, which you want to think is really difficult to move past the shoulders. That's kind of like your goal right there. Um, with that heavier resistance band, and then you're gonna have a medium to lighter one, stretches pretty decently. Um, moving out with that, we'll use that for our obliques and then the start of arms. Um, and then I'm gonna start with one heavy hand weight because I got one tin right here, but you can easily use um, some light ones and stuff like that too. Uh, but we do have a carriage sit up uh, in our ab section as we warm up here. So you're gonna want just something to lift up. You can easily do it without any weight. It's just something that's that added little core ignition right there, so like igniting into that core, getting everything moving, working into that right there. So with that said, that is our equipment. Keep it nearby. Grab that sip of water. Ah, let's get it going. Let's get it going Friday. So I'm gonna pop off those comments just so we can see everything through this here and we will all get started. Perfect guys. All right, there we go. Cool. You see like the lighting right there. I'm like, I have a sunrise alarm clock and it works great. I don't have one of those like rim lights or anything, but I'm like, mm, this will work. This will work. It's improvising, right guys? Okay. Getting those abs going, getting those abs started here. You're just going to meet me in a high plank. I want you to find those discs, keep them relatively close. So move your stuff in and out of the way, but also reachable, accessible right here. Feet come back onto those discs. I want you to use both discs because we got that inner thigh plank coming up in a minute, but hands are coming down onto that mat, shoulders out of the ears, core in tight, just hold. Just hold, starting off the morning right here, starting off that energy. So, shoulders out of the ears. Here we go. Push the heels behind you. Squeeze, drive through the hands. Now scoop the abs in, belly button back to spine. Chin off the chest, good you guys, right here. All right, super slow controlled movements. You got just 20 seconds left to hold right here. Take a few breaths. Ooh, breathe in that morning air. Set the tone for your day. I want you to pick right now, pick an energy, pick a feeling that you want to accomplish in here that you want to carry on throughout this workout and bring into the rest of that day. Pick that word, that phrase, let's go. We get ready in six. We're going right into those plank inner thighs. You can do one leg at a time for level one. Level one, one leg at a time. Or level two, we get ready, both legs go out in three, two, one, slow for four, three, two, hold, pull it back in for four, three, 
two paws right there, right back out. So every time you send it out, hips are still holding up, tabletop. Squeeze it in. Use those inner thighs to draw in, squeeze right there, reach along with the body. Push through the hands. Inhale, exhale, scoop back, good. So don't let those hips drop through at all. Scoop the low abs in. 20 seconds right here. Push it up, drive through. Squeeze right back in, reach. Continue to push away with those hands. Good, you guys, you got 10. Woo, hold on to it, stay with it right here. We get ready in five. Pull it all the way and hold for me again in three, two, hold right here, hold. Shoulders out of the ears, core and tight. Good, you guys, you can drop down to just one disc. We're going right into that plank to pipe. Otherwise, you go both disc in three, in two, one, hips lift, hips lift. Stop right as soon as you start to feel your toes get heavy again, then reach it long. Extend it, push it out, reach, hold, exhale, squeeze it up. Squeeze, squeeze, tuck that chin to the chest, look back to the toes, look back to the shin. Slowly take it right back out and away. Use those low abs, control it right here, exhale, breathe. Hold, inhale, take it out, four. Good, so the reason we use that four count right here is that four count is what allows us to take out all the momentum. Just use that resistance right here. Breathe it out. Take it out, last time, all the way up, all the way down, come on. I'm gonna get you off those hands from here. Take it up, take it all the way out. Good, you guys, in six. Ooh, I want you to find that hand weight. We get ready, carriage sit-ups in three, two, one, let's go. Okay, take whatever hand weight, one or both. You're gonna hold yourself down into that seated position. Feet come up, you get ready. We're gonna roll it down right here. So scoop the low abs, roll, place one vertebrae down at a time. Hover the shoulder blades, now lift it up. Squeeze, stop the shoulders before they come in front of the hips, take it right back down. Scoop, scoop low. Curl down right there. Now those heels stay planted. I want you to push those heels into the floor beneath you the whole time. Part of the challenge, holding it down. Stay with it, hover, hold, exhale. Breathe it up, squeeze. Inhale to the top, back down. There you go. Good, you guys, you got this right here. Hang on to this, pace that tempo. Every time you come down, I want you to get, feel like you're scooping. Scoop, roll, 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 roll. Cover the shoulder blades, pop the chest open, and lift straight up. Lift straight up with that control, with that reach. Take it back down. There we go. Good, you guys, you got just another 10. We're gonna hold it halfway. Hold it halfway, meet me there in four, three, two, hold it halfway. Option to bring that weight in. Otherwise, send it out, we get ready. Little inches, let's go, down an inch. Up an inch, hold. Keep those heels planted, down an inch. Up an inch, hold, yes you can. Come on, you're right here. Just 10, breathe it out, Whew. Stay onto it, chest open, core tight. For six, breathe with it, we're gonna ditch that weight. Meet me in an upside down bear in three, two, one. Okay, so find that upside down plank. Reach it out, shoulders out of the ears, arms are up like you're stacking into that plank. Now bend those knees in. Stop before the knees come in front of the hips. Reach it out long. Extend, hold. Exhale, squeeze in four, three, two, pause, take it out. Reach, breathe, lengthen out, squeeze it back in. There you go, good, you guys. So important, those knees are not coming in front of those hips. Keep the chin off the chest. Keep the gaze to the ceiling right here. Woo. 15 seconds, come on. Good, you guys, you got it right here. Lock into it, keep it strong. Hanging on so good. We finish with those discs. Coming underneath, we're gonna finish in that wheelbarrow. You gotta hold right here in six, take it out. Hold in three, two, hold it there, hold it. Reach the hands a little higher. Pull the shoulder blades up, squeeze the inner thighs in, pull everything, that core is so dang tight. Find those discs. We go wheelbarrow. Meet me in a kneeling push-up position. In three, two, one. Okay. Both hands come onto those discs right here. Knees are onto that mat. So meet me in that kneeling push-up position. 
Start there. Slowly hinge out. Reach just at the shoulders. Hold. Now watch out low body. It doesn't move. Drag through the heel of the hands. Come on back in. Level one, you can do this with one hand at a time. Taking it just one hand at a time. That same reach. That same power pushing it to it right here. You want to level it up. Both hands go. But it's slow. Right here. Lock in. Good, you guys. That core is going to be working from start to finish in this class. So 45 minutes where I want that belly button to hug back into that spine. Yes, you can. Stay on to it here. Good, you guys. Here's that fight. We do not come back to those center abdominals till the very, very end of class right here. I want you to go for that shake. Pull it in. In. Stop the hands sooner. Woo. That reach right there. Come on. Hang with it. Breathe it out. Reach a little further than you want to, then pull it back in just as slow. Slow. Drive it. Last 10. Let's go. Hold it out. Hold it there. I want it to get shaky. Push the shins down. Don't let those toes come out. Push them down. Hold in three, two. Hold. Eight second hold right here. So good. So strong. Right onto it. Don't let it go. Whew, we get ready. We got a floor lunge. Find those hand weights. Right foot forward in three, in two, in one, let's go right here. Okay, find those hand weights. Take that right foot forward, left foot onto that disc. Drop it down, reach low into that lunge. Hold there a second. Shoulders out of the ears, core tight. Frame that ankle, frame it with those weights. Feel the abs pull up away from the quad. Right here, you got eight. We're gonna get ready. We start to rise. Just little one inch pulses, let's go. Little one inch lift and lower it down. That right leg strong. In three, in two, in one. Squeeze the right glute up an inch, hold. Squeeze it down an inch, pause. There you go, one inch pulses. 10 seconds right here. Dig through the heel, keep the toes light. Little soft, take it up, breathe. Take it right back down. We go full range. Find that four count in three. Here we go, in two, in one. Rise it up for four. Stand through that front leg for three, two. Stop there, take it down, go four. Go three, two, pause, abs tight. Now squeeze, take your gaze forward. Roll the shoulders out of the ears, pull the core in tight. Now squeeze your inner thighs towards each other so that as you're working right here, that toe's not behind the other ankle. Your hips are squared. Keep that even line and then stand through, pull, and keep that left hip forward in line with the right right here. Take it down. Good, you guys. Hold it down. Get that long jump. Hold hands. Go back in three, two. Hold it here. Little pulses with those arms. Those same one inches. Up an inch. Down an inch. Come on. Up an inch. Down an inch. You got ten. Push it up. Breathe. All right. Lock in right here. Heart rate's starting to pick up. Focus into that breath. Your breath is connected directly to that core. You gotta keep them in check. Let's go for four. We go back full range. Frame that first, first foot first in three, two, one. Come up for four. Woo, three, two, there it goes. It's warming up right here. Because you guys, you got just 20 seconds. 20 seconds of that full range. Come on, push into it here. We're gonna finish with those one inch pulses that you started with. Same ones, set the tone, put the work in. Let's go. We're gonna find that heavy resistance band after these pulses, take it down in six. Take it down in three, two, hold it. Remember those one inch pushes. Let's go, push it up an inch. Take it down an inch, hold. Whew. There we go, up an inch. Take it down an inch, hold. Come on Friday, let's go. Little fight, stay here, last six. Find that heavy resistance band. In three, in two, in one. Okay, we're going spider lunge. Take that heavy resistance band, strap it around the quads. Right foot onto the floor, left foot on that disc. Right foot planted, come down into a low squat. Turn the left knee out like I can see the inner thigh on the left. Now push it back at a diagonal hold. Stay low into that right squatted leg right here. Whew, everything pushes out. Drive, drive, hold. Stop before the leg locks out. I wanna see the inside of that left inner thigh the entire time. So the right leg is planted down. 
the left extends, reaches off of it. So this is your anchored side. This is your anchor point. Hold into it, drop low. So then as you push back, back in that diagonal. Slowly take it in, stop the knee in line with the hip, push it out. Hold, take it right back in, let's go, push it out. Drive, good you guys. All right, we've got two inches on this challenge here. I held up three, but I'm at two. Let's go, we got just eight. Whew. Push into it here, hold it halfway in four, hold it halfway in three, two, hold it halfway, sit down an inch. Push it out one, hold, one more time, down an inch. Push it out two, hold, two inches, bring it in one, in two, okay. That outer glute, outer thigh, starting to fire up. You feel that work right there. Keep the hands to prayer, keep that elevation. Now get that back flat, get that spine in line. So it's a flat, neutral spine. The whole time, sit your hips back and down. Little two inches, last 10. Good, you guys, you go back to that full range one more time. I promise you I'm gonna let you stand out of that leg. We're gonna come up, we're going into outer thigh squats from here. We're gonna equal out that way, right and left. That's gonna be our recovery. But I want you right here to go full range in three, two, one. Go at your slowest, go at your lowest. Final 20 seconds here. Everything pushes, go reach. Whoo, stay on to it right here. Go back to that word, back to that phrase. Yes, you can right here. Stay with it, drop a little bit lower. Last 10 seconds. Give me one more, all the way in, all the way out. Come on, let's go. Hold there, push it out for four. Whew. Outer thigh squats for three, two, one. Ditch that disc, bring that feet nice and narrow, or nice and wide. Take it down, hold. Slowly come up just over that halfway, pause. Feel the weight start to equal out. Drop it down, down, breathe. Come up, two, hold. Okay guys, equal weight right and left. We're sitting that squat all the way down. Roll into those heels, cover the toes, pull the core in tight. Come up just that halfway. I want you to get aware, the second you start to feel the back of the glutes, disengage. That's when you come too high. You stop before that, take it down and roll it back from there. Breathe, take it up. Squeeze, there we go. Hit those inches. We're gonna hold it down in 10. Take it all the way down. Hold it low for me. We're gonna give little pulses, little butterfly legs in three, two, hold it. Now push it out one, in one. Let's go, push it out one, in one. Come on, squeeze, press into it. Both glutes working. Take it just into the knees, point it over the second, third toe. You got six for four. Back to full range, final 30 seconds in three, two, down first, down first. Parallel out those feet, right here. Take it right back down, go low, low. Drop into it. Good, you guys, we're going right into that runner's lunge on the right. We're gonna take that band, take it around the legs. Left foot comes onto that disc. Pivot, give me that runner's lunge in eight. Whew, here we go, in three, two, one, pivot, so it goes around the front of the right shin, back of that left hamstring, drop it down, pull into that left leg, let's go. Push it out, reach. So it's like a runner's lunge, so think about ready, set, go, like a runner. Now pop up the chest, push it back from there. That's where it gets that name. So the abs are in tight, you're stacked like you're gonna launch off of that front leg. So if you were doing a runner's lunge, if you're going into a sprint, push it back. All the power would come from that front standing leg to push off, to drive into it. That's what I want you to use to push the back leg away. Feel the back of the glute. Lock into that right leg right here. Good, you guys, this is that last pushing movement. Hang on to it, breathe. Take it in an inch, drop down, take it out. Push, reach, come on, right back in. Good, you guys, this is it with that heavy resistance band. Right foot again is forward, hips square. Push back and away. Keep that back heel so lifted. Take it in, take it down. Squeeze your inner thighs towards each other. Good, you guys, here comes those inches. Here come those inches in 10. You're gonna hold it, we got three of them. We're gonna finish out, it's one challenge, one set. Take it in, halfway in three, two, one. Let's go with me, deep breath in. Down an inch, hold. 
Deep breath in, press it back an inch, hold. Two more, breathe it in. Exhale, take it down. Breathe it in. Exhale, push it back, I know it's shaking. One more, breathe it in. Exhale, sit down. Breathe it in, exhale, push it back. Now just those three inches off the back of the leg. In, two, three, stop there. Take it out for one, for two, three. Ooh, let it shake, let it burn right here. So good, good you guys, you got it. Fire it up, reach into this here. Yes, you can, come on, commit to it. Stay with it here. We got just another six. We find that medium resistance band, we're finishing with those bungee kicks. In five, in four, three, two, let's go. Okay, take that medium resistance band, place it around both feet, come into a tabletop, get there, we get ready, we move quick. Tabletop it down, knees go down, Heat comes up, push it up. Okay, let's finish it out, right leg, is shaking. You are only got a 60 second bungee. Right here, I need 60 seconds all out. Push it up. Take it down an inch. There we go, push it up. Take it down an inch, squeeze the inner thighs in, push it up. Take it down an inch, squeeze the inner thighs. Come on, core tight. Okay, there's that shake, let's go. Push. Remember, this is all we're gonna ask of that right leg here this morning. So as you work into it, use that little shake, use that tension, come on, fight it up. Push, take it down an inch, there you go. Push it up, breathe, take it down an inch, don't let it go. Last 10, to move, you got one 10 second hold. In four, three, two, hold it right here. This is tug of war. This is all the way up as high as you possibly can. Good, you guys, you got this right here. We're gonna keep it strapped onto that right leg. Strap it onto that right leg. In four, we're going right into that soul train. In three, in two, and one, let's go. So banded soul train. Keep the, the strap onto that right foot. Hands come into the band. Twisting opposite knee, opposite elbow. Twist, hold. Whew. Switch it over. Twist, freeze. Take it back over. Squeeze, drive. There we go, right here. Alternating right to left. Guess what, that right leg's done but we get it going to that oblique series here. Twist it out, inhale, exhale, right here. So you're working both obliques, but we're getting more of that tension by pushing away and driving from that right side. Squeeze, take it over. There we go. Shoulders out of the ears, core tight. Inhale, squeeze. Take it, you can easily do this with hand weights. So if you wanna take that hand weight into that hand, you can do that right here. Whew. If you don't have a band that's stretching up, use that resistance too. Choke up onto it, pull it up. Final 20 seconds, go slow. Breathe, twist, slow, slow. Breathe, twist, there we go. I want you to hold it over. Right elbow, left knee in three, hold it in two, one, hold it right here. Little squeezes, go pulse, pulse, bring it in, pulse, you're squeezing against that band. Little inches right here for six, whew. for four, we get ready, mermaid in three, in two, in one, let's go. Dish it right here, left knee down, right leg long. Take those hands out, hold. Slowly take it up just 80% of the way, pause. Take it right back up, so it's that long, long line. Create it, reach with it, come up just that halfway. Use that right oblique, right here, take it out. Whew. Take it here, reach. You ever wanna add more, reach the hands. That's gonna level it right on up. Take it out, breathe, reach tall. Squeeze, now see how that shoulder it's never gonna stack on top of that hip. So stop before the shoulder comes over the hip. Take it out. Breathe. Reach it up. Everything is reaching long with that body. Separate each vertebrae. Make the crown of the head shoot out long. Hang into this here. Whew. There we go. 15 seconds. 
Good, you guys, you're gonna hold it. Reach it out in eight. One more, all the way down, all the way up. Find that sweet spot. Get so honest with me right here from Friday. Let's go. Three, two, hold it, reach. Hold and reach. Yes, you can. Stay here. We find those discs. One or two, we're going into that dancing bear on the right. In three, two, one, let's go. Okay, here you go. Take those discs, either both or one. You get ready, feet come onto that disc, hands come over. Level one, cross up just the right leg, left elbow. Take it right back out, squeeze. There you go, so single leg, level one right there. Take it back, breathe. There you go, squeeze, drive. Level two, both feet together, 30 seconds, come on. Go, squeeze it in, in, twist it out, take it back. Breathe, reach it long, right back in. There you go. Squeeze, hold, take it out, so strong. Push the heels behind you, reach the crown of the head long. Twist it out, breathe. Squeeze your inner thighs in together. Now remember those hips, they do not drop, they just hold right in that sweet spot. That shoulder height. Squeeze, take it out. Last 10, all the way in, all the way out, let's go. Twist it. Twist it here, hold, hold a second. Let's go, take it back for four. Good, you guys, this time left foot comes forward for that floor lunge. In three, in two, one, let's go. Okay, left foot forward, hands come onto that hand weight, right foot's back, take it down. Lunge it back into this here. I got like one disc that has something sticky on the bottom of it, and it's dragging. <laughs> okay, so if I'm switching it to finding the lighter one, there you go. Let's go, right here, left foot. Frame the foot, take it down, hold. First 20 seconds, just hold. Shoulders out of the ears, core in tight. Get the chest open. Even though you're hinging at the chest, it's still open. Reach the collarbones wall to wall. Pull the shoulder blades back and down. Push through the heel, one inch pushes. Squeeze the left glute. So I want you to picture that left glute like a hand. Now make a fist with it. Take it down, but don't fully unclench the fist. You know how you can still have a clenched hand, but it's not in a full fist? That's how your glute should be the whole time. But then you just squeeze it in extra hard, take it right back out. That's how we're creating that little lift. Pressing through that front left leg. First six, we go up to full range. Go slow. In three, two, one, up four. Up three, two, stop there, take it down. Go reach, breathe it out. There we go, stop there, take it right back up. Two, three, hold, you got just 20 seconds on this full range before we take it into that long jump hold. Hands are gonna come back behind us. We're gonna reach it down in eight. Take it down, hands come back in four, in three, two, hold it here, pulse it up, go up an inch. Down an inch, push through that left leg. Remember that glute that you were flexing? Make a fist with that left leg right here. Let's go. Last eight. Abs are not onto that quad, so you're not folding into this. You're pulling up and into it. Last six. Here we go, full range, reach it down in three, two, one. Climb it up, up, Woo! left leg fires up. All right, guys, now this is nothing that you haven't done before. All we're doing is evening out. It's not that extra work. It's just giving the same evening out onto that left leg. Here we go. Last 15 seconds to move. All the way up, all the way down, come on. I want you to hold your next one low for me. Take it down, hold. We finish with those one inch pulses. In three, two, let's go, 10 seconds. Little pushes, we're gonna find that heavy resistance band. Take it around, find that spider lunge. In three, two, one, okay, Whew. left leg is firing. Here we go, okay. Resistance band right around the quad. Left foot comes forward. Right foot comes onto that disc right here. Left foot forward, right foot on that disc. Squat it down. Turn the inside of that right inner thigh so you can see it. Push back at that diagonal. Slowly take it in, stop halfway. Everything just shot right over to that outer glute, outer thigh. You can push into it right here, go low. Lock it in, let's go. Push it out, four, 
three, two, hold, take it in, squeeze, anchor down that left side right here, anchor it down so that as you push back, it does not move, hold into it, stay with it strong, keep with it here, all right, I'm with you, Friday, let's go, let it work, let it burn, if you're already feeling that sensation through the outer glute, outer thigh, that's exactly where you should be, push, open up, See the right inner thigh into that front mirror. Take it out. Hold it halfway in six. Hold it halfway. Okay. Three, two, let's go. Down an inch. Out one. Down two. Out two. Two inches. In one. Whew. In two. Come on, breathe. Out one. Out two. Little pushes. It's 15 seconds, come on, sit lower. I know everything is firing into that. That left leg is screaming at you right now. Anchor down, do not roll into the big toe. Keep the outside of that foot planted, keep the core tight. Last six, you go back to full range. One more time, sit it low. Three, two, one, push it back. Push it back, hold, keep that knee open. Take it in, stop that knee and hip height. Take it right back out, reach it long. There you go. Remember, we're gonna get a stand out of this. We're going into those outer thigh squats. Both legs get to work, but you give me one more. Full 10 count. All the way out, all the way out. Come on, bring it in. Let's go. For six, take it back out. For four, for three, for two, one. Take it off, squat it down, go low. Whoo, even out. Take it back. We're here, guys. You got this, fight into it, push it, sink it low, take it up, inch by inch, drop that squat, pull the abs up, look right out in front of you, roll into those heels, take it up, breathe, stop there, take it right back down, inhale, take it low, Whew. come back to that breath right here. I know so many times we start to hold it, I want you to take huge deep breaths, as you hold into this tempo, as you hold this pace, chest up, core tight, let's go. Come on, 7.30, you did not set that alarm. You did not make everything happen to get here and do this, to give up right here. This is where you came to get a little shaky, to get a little stronger, to let those legs remind you all day long the effort you put in. Hold it down in six, butterfly it out in three, two, push it out an inch. In an inch, here we go. Squeeze, I want you to imagine like you're trying to throw the outside of those knees to the back wall behind you, pull them. Take it in, pull, squeeze the glutes, take it back in, this is it. We don't even go back to that full range, you're just gonna step that left foot forward. We go runner's lunge, drop a little lower. In four, three, two, let's go. Take it around the front of the left shin. Come into that runner's leg. I want you to even pretend. Go into that runner's first side. Where would that be? Come up from there. Feel that little engagement, that alignment of the hips and core. Push back and away. Drive it in. That left heel should be planted so firm into the floor. Dig into it. Woo, let's go. Out four. Three. Two, hold. Take it back in. Breathe. Hit those 90s. Come on. Stay with it, stay with it. Take it right back in. Breathe, good. So I like to try and get that band to be parallel with the floor. Push back through that front left leg. Okay, anyone else's left leg screaming at them right now? Mine is telling me that it is working so hard. Breathe it out, stay with it. We get ready, we've got 20 seconds left to that full range. Remember, we just got those three inches. That one challenge, that one set, you're way, way too close. Come on, hold that sweet spot. Meet me halfway, hold it there in three, two, three inches. Breathe in, exhale down an inch. Breathe in, exhale out an inch. Do it again, in, exhale down one. Breathe it in, exhale out one. One more time, breathe it in, take it down. Breathe it in, push it out three inches. Ooh, let's go, 25 seconds, come on, yes you can. Let's go, fight for it. 
little inches. I'm coaching myself through this one right here. Everything in my body is telling me to stand up, but I know that it feels so much better to give that little shake, that little inch. Hang in here with you. I won't quit if you don't. Last 10. Stay with it. Come on. Last little fight. We find that band. We're going bungee. In four. In three. In two. One. Okay. Here we go. All right, take that bungee, strap it around both feet. This is that last little finale. That push for that left leg. Take it up, straight up, let's go. Push it up, breathe. Take it down an inch, core tight, let's go. Up, flex that heel. Squeeze your inner thighs back towards each other. All right, guys, 60 seconds. Come on, push up, breathe. Down an inch, Whew. up two, three, hold. Down just one, come on. Fight with it right here. Let's go. This is where we feel the top of that glute. Let little work. Right connecting the hamstring and the glute. Pull it up. Pull your abs away from the floor. Push strong through those hands. Close those eyes. Just focus in. Right here. You choose right now. I say it a lot in my classes, but there's something that happens when you make that mental decision that you are not going to quit for 20 seconds. That's it. 20 seconds. Give yourself that challenge. Push it up. We get ready, we hold those last 10. Hold it your highest, get that tug of war up in three, two, hold it, hold it, get a little higher. Hold it up, flex it in, squeeze it up a little higher. Yes, you can, you got this here for just another four. We get ready, flip it over, soul train, three, two, one. Okay, banded soul train, keep it around that left foot. Come into that tabletop position, or that tailbone stall position. Find that band, left foot, twist it, Start with the band in the side. Just hit that elbow, send the right leg long. Now find that left oblique as you twist and turn. Take it back out and away. Whew. There we go. Breathe. Guess what, Friday? The legs are done. Oh my gosh, that is the best feeling in the world. Whew. But we got work to do. We got work to happen right here. Through that waistline, twist it out. Hold yourself back into that little floated position so you're not on your tailbone, you're on that little flat spot right above it. Take it out, open up that chest, look up to the ceiling. Pull it up, squeeze it out. Breathe, use control through that waistline right here. Last 10, hold it over. To the right, left knee, right elbow, hold it in three, two, hold it, little pulse, pulse, release, squeeze, release. That right knee, the one that doesn't have the band, is gonna find the floor, in four, mermaid, on the left, in three, in two, in one, let's go, kick it off that band, all right. Right knee down, left leg long, Hands go out, take it out, reach, hold, squeeze it up, breathe it right here. Squeeze, lengthen out, okay, find that oblique right here. Reach it out, lengthen, squeeze. So the whole time right here, again, it's toe, hip, shoulders, all one long line. Squeeze it up, twist, 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 open that chest. Get the hips square, belly button should be going straight to the wall in front of you. There you go. If you took that out of challenge, reach it out. Squeeze it up. You can take that hand, you can take it up. Whew. Those obliques fire up every time. Right here, breathe it out. Exhale, take it up. There we go, right here. We hold in six, hold it out. In three, two, hold, hold it there. Challenge it out, come on. Give it one more inch, lengthen it out. We find those discs, we get ready. You're going single-sided dancing bear. Knees are coming to the right elbow. In three, two, one, let's go. Okay guys, you got both discs for one of those discs. Hands go to the mat, find a high plank position, hold there. Hold there in three, two, one, okay. Set in, good you guys. This is your last and final oblique movement of class. I want you to make it count. If it's level one, you're crossing left knee, right elbow, just one. Level two, let's go. We got that timer set. Come on, pull it in. Squeeze, hold, hips up, tabletop. 
I want you to imagine folding in on that left oblique. This is where we're squeezing into. Fold it in half. Pull it over. Fold it. Fold it. Squeeze in. It's like you're bringing the top of your left hip to come and say hello, good morning, to the bottom of that left rib cage. Squeeze it in. Breathe. Push through those hands. Roll the shoulders out of the air. Squeeze your inner thighs in so dang tight. Your low body should be working as one line so that everything happens in the left oblique. I want you to imagine letting your entire body hold still and strong and just move with the left oblique. Don't let any other movement happen unless the left oblique is going. What happens? Where do you get deeper into that side? Good, you guys, we hold this next one in. Hold it in in six. Hold it in, yes you can. In three, two, hold it. Hold it, stay right there. Good, you guys. We get ready. Find that resistance too. Meet me for triceps in three, in two, in one. Let's go, okay. Resistance two, coming on. Take that resistance move right underneath the ankles. We're going right into those tricep extensions. Take it out and away. Come back behind, take it up. Slowly take it right back down. Woo. Breathe it out. There we go. All right, guys, last five minutes of class. You're into it. Push those triceps all the way up. Get the shoulders out of the ears, core tight. So I want you to keep that gap between the shoulders and the ears. Lift with the back of the hands. Let them go all the way up to the ceiling. Pull them up, up. Stop there, take it down. Stop into that 90. Lift it back up, squeeze. Now you're not torquing the booty out, tuck it under. Squeeze it outside, yes you can. Good, you guys, 15 seconds left to move. Squeeze, pull into the triceps, then lengthen them out. Last 10. Breathe into it, stay with it. Good, you guys, you got this right here. Whew, we're gonna take those arms forward. We go right into those arm circles. Here we go, take it out in three, two, one. Take your arms out, two, three, hold. Now close them back in front of you. Squeeze, lift the hands, pull it up. Reach, take it out, open, arm circles all the way in front of you. You can do that with those hand weights right here. Lift up through the front of the shoulders. Open with the lats, squeeze, hold, resist. Close with the chest, close it in. Squeeze, hold, up, four, three, two, hold, take it out, wide. Reach with it here. Good, everything is fighting into that upper body. Stay into it here. All right, guys, 20 seconds left to move. Whew. And we're gonna switch up that direction. Those arms do not drop. That is the challenge here. No holds, no pulses. We just, the second the arms go up, they stay up, they stay working. That's where we get that time under tension. That's where we get those lean back muscles. Let's go. Last eight. Switch out that direction in three. Pull it out wide, two, one. Take it out, out. Hold, close it in. Relax the jaw, relax the face. Take the exhale, out through the mouth. Take the inhale, fill the lungs. Take it right back up, let's go. Squeeze it to the top, hold it down. All right, right about now, it's getting a little shaky. They're getting that little challenge out, hold into it. Stay with it, breathe it out. Woo. There you go. Squeeze through the back, squeeze, hold wide. Exhale, lift tall, inhale, right back in. You're on right here. You give me 20 seconds left of these arm circles. Because you guys, but the work's not done. We're gonna hold those arms out. You're going right to that hug a tree. Yes, I said it, we got this. Come on, it's a 30 second hug a tree in four. Arms go wide in three. Don't let them drop two. One, now just close in. In, hold, oh, shoulders, hello, hi, good morning. <laughs> let's go, pull it back in, in. Two, outside, let's go, give me three more. Three more, let's go, come on. Right here, fight for it, all the way through the finish. Squeeze, take it out, breathe. Good, you guys, be finished with that kneeling shoulder press in three, Woo. in two, in one, let's go, take it up, okay. Final 60 seconds of that upper body. Push it up, push it out and away. Take it out. 
go wide. If you need that little modification, you can sit back onto those heels. But right here, I want you to fight for it because it's less than 30 seconds. Go slow, elbows wide, push up, drive up, hold. Okay, my arms are shaking. Hi, Friday. Whew. Push into it, stay wide, stay wide. Open that chest, breathe it up. Breathe it here, squeeze it in. Give me one more, so slow. Give me a six count up for six, for four, three, two, hold just as slow on the way back out. We get ready. You find that plank in three, disc under in two, one. All right, plank it out. Take one of those discs underneath those feet. Last 60 seconds of class, you're here. Push it out, hold. Shoulders out of the ears, core in tight. First 20 seconds, you're gonna hold. Second 20 seconds, you're gonna give me that bear, that plank to pipe, whatever that body is telling you. You wanna take that giant wheelbarrow, give it that little saw, and then we're gonna meet for those last 20 to hold together. We're in this together, Friday, come on. In three, two, one, let's go, pull it in. There you go, knees come underneath the hips, hold. Take it out, breathe, breathe. Reach it, yes you can, you can do that plank to pipe. You can do that flying wheelbarrow, but you got 10 seconds left to move where you choose what that body needs right here. You meet me still in six. Whew. One more wherever you are, whatever that combo is, whatever you've given yourself. In three, two, hold. Hold it here, last 20 seconds. I know those arms are fighting, pull the abs in tight. Remember, that plank, you are not just dropping the hips, scoop them up and in. Punch yourself in the step. Pull it in. Let's go. You got just 10. Stay on to it. Breathe it out. We find that child's pose in eight. Whew. In six. Breathe. In four. Three. Two. You are done. Take that child's pose. Melt it down. Oh, Friday. You did it. You're incredible. You are so so strong let's stretch it out thank you guys so much for being here as you hold that child's pose as you start to bring some movement into that body oh, we're gonna stretch take it forward oh let's start with just a few cat cows that feels good especially with those shoulders so just reach around that spine Friday. You guys are beautiful. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you guys for moving with me, moving with bodies. Reach the right hand, flip it under. Hold it, stretch it. Whew. Alternating, switching other side. Reach with it. Oh, sometimes I feel like those arms just, whew, those shoulders need to open up. Good, you guys, taking one more time. Cat cow, round through it here. And step that right foot forward, let's lunge it out. Oh, you guys, if you have any questions, need anything right here, this is like when I do a little Q&A. So if you shoot them up, I can actually see my phone in comments now, I'm close enough. Uh, if you have something, otherwise you can always, always reach out to me, shoot me a quick message. All right, take it back, reach back, grab that back foot. Stretch into it, find that front of that hip flexor. Open it. Oh, you guys are beautiful. I hope you guys have the best weekend. Um, make the most of it, love on your people. Um, try to make as much just joy as you can into it. Take that left foot forward. Whew, there we go. Take it in, lunge it down, reach out, left hand up, take it back, reach back for that right foot. Good. Lunging down into this right here. Squeeze shoulders out of the ears. Core it tight. Good. All right. Let's take it on. Both feet forward. Both feet come forward. Take a huge inhale for me right here. Thank you guys. Happy Good Friday to you too. Take a huge inhale up. No matter where you are, no matter what you have planned for this weekend. 
fill it with love because you are loved. Take it up, take it over. Fold it down. Roll it up one vertebrae at a time. Roll the shoulders out of the ears. You guys, enjoy the rest of your guys' day. Go be that light, go shine on others. Call a loved one, reach out to someone you care about. It means so much um, to have you guys here and I'm just so grateful. So I will see you guys soon. Have a great rest of your day. If I see you at 5.30, awesome, cool. Um, if I see you in my DMs, you got questions, shoot them out. Totally here for you, whatever you guys